In the October 2013 General Conference, President Dieter F. Uchtdorf made the following statement. At a time where many churches throughout the world are experiencing significant decreases in numbers, the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints is one of the fastest growing churches in the world. And you heard President Monson today, more than 15 million now. Implicit in President Uchtdorf's statement is a direct relationship between the growth rate of the church and its status as the only true church of Jesus Christ. He made this relationship explicit in his very next statement. There are many reasons for this, but may I offer just a few. First, this church was restored in our day by Jesus Christ himself. This is a significant claim by President Uchtdorf that the rate of the growth of a church is a measure of its truthfulness. Yet, President Uchtdorf admitted that the church is not the fastest growing church, but only one of the fastest growing churches. The corollary to this numerical logic is that the total membership of a church is also a measure of its truthfulness. Though President Uchtdorf did not mention this explicitly, it is a natural outcome of his logic. This is why he emphasized the 15 million member milestone. Though the text of this conference talk has been altered to downplay his claims, he said what he said and the numerical logic still holds. The church claims in its newsroom that it is the second fastest growing church in the United States. The church cites the National Council of Churches as the source for this claim. It does not clarify which church is the fastest growing. Immediately following the growth rate claim, the church makes a disclaimer, stating that the church cautions against overemphasis on growth statistics and denies making comparisons with other Christian denominations. But how can this be when the church publicly posts its growth rate in comparison to other churches and when a member of the First Presidency does the same in General Conference? The most recent issue of the Yearbook of American and Canadian Churches, published by the National Council of Churches, does corroborate that the church placed second in growth rate by percentage. The top three fastest growing churches were the Assemblies of God, the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints, and the Seventh-day Adventists. But this begs another question. The growth rate for the Assemblies of God was more than twice that of the LDS Church. Using President Uchtdorf's numerical measure of truthfulness, that would make the Assemblies of God the true Church of Jesus Christ, or at least the truest Church of Jesus Christ. In terms of total membership, the Roman Catholic Church is by far the largest Christian denomination with over a billion members. From this perspective, the Pope can theoretically make the claim that his church is the true church of Jesus Christ. Certainly, it claims to be the universal church, which is what Catholic Church means. So which church is the true church of Jesus Christ? Is it the Assemblies of God, which is growing more than twice as fast as the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints? Is it the Roman Catholic Church, which has almost 100 times the membership of the LDS Church? Or is it the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints, simply because President Uchtdorf claims that its relatively rapid rate of growth is due in part to the fact that Jesus Christ himself restored it. <laughs>